Hi, everyone. Let's take a look at number seven on page 362 for grade 12 calculus and vectors, MCV for you. Using a vector diagram explain why it is easier to do chin-ups when your hands are 30 centimeters apart instead of 90 centimeters apart. Assume that the force exerted by your arms is the same in both cases. Here we go. So here's the first diagram. And I'm going to set up the second one adjacent to the first one. Now, um, in a different color, what I'm going to do is this. Imagine this entire distance is going to be 90 centimeters. So you can divide this into three pieces, of course. And if I kind of just take one of these measurements, I can say this is roughly speaking 30 centimeters. And now what happens is you want to find out um, the difference in terms of uh, is it easier or is that harder for that chin up? So you draw the two vectors, right? And again, assuming the arms are the same length, maybe I should draw a more reasonable diagram. So let's say these two arms look like that, right? Now, if they're the same length, then the arms look roughly speaking, something like that. These are human arms, human arms. So again, there's the left arm, there's the right arm, same idea. There's the left arm and there's the right arm, okay? So the key question is, um, which one is easier and why? If you look at the first case carefully, you want to break this down to two components. There's the vertical component. There's the horizontal component. I'm going to switch colors for you, everybody. Remember, chin up really means you're pulling up, right? You're trying to pull and push, so to speak, in a vertical manner. So the reason why I want to break this into components is because in the first case, notice how horizontally speaking, that is the magnitude and vertically, those are the magnitudes. Now compare that to the second case. See, anyone who would like to try this as an experiment, I can tell you right now, a wide pull up, it's always going to be more difficult in general for the same person versus a more standard, a more narrow um, pull-up. And the reason is because of this horizontal component. So remember, when you do a pull-up, you're pulling it vertically. And you also have to overcome the horizontal part. So the reason why, in general, 90 centimeters is more challenging or more difficult is because even if you hold the arms at 90 centimeters um, wide, um, you have to overcome a lot more horizontal component. Now, in terms of the vertical component, again, notice in the 30 centimeter case, this is longer or more than the second case, which is 90 centimeters. In summary, in the first case, because the vertical components are longer, it takes less strength to do a chin up. Whereas in the second case, because the vertical component is relatively shorter than the first case, um, there's a lot more force that you need to overcome gravity. I hope that makes sense.